Welcome back to Return to Dark Souls 3 everyone. Here we are at the Gale boss fight. So this is how it's gonna go, because this game, not this game, this boss can take a lot of attempts. I think I'll show this first attempt on screen and then the next attempt you'll see is just me beating him. Because I don't know how long it's gonna take. I'd like it not to take too long. But... Kind of out of my control, right? All right. Maybe I'm in. I'm gonna be in Quan mode. Um, I'll beat him quickly, but I don't think so. But hey, you never know. Cheating, healing. Basically, in this game, right, you... Because healing happens, like, mega, mega quickly. You probably avoid running out of stamina. Man, this weapon is good. Doink, in fact. Doink is what I would call it. Alright, this is the tough phase. Am I even in human form? I don't, yeah, yeah, I am. Shit, no, I'm not. That was my chance to buff up. The boy fucked up. And return to Vander. Return to Sender. I said return to Ender because that's something we have at work, but return to Sender is an Isaac item, which, wait, is it an Isaac item? Pretty sure, something like that, shit. Man, this boss is a bitch. Yeah, I saw the lightning. That move, <clears throat> that's the move that always gets me. So that strategy wasn't too bad, I just, uh, I healed up at the wrong time. Alright, next attempt, you'll either see this or you won't, <laughs> depending on how it's gonna go. That, again, it's not, I wasn't paying attention to my heals enough and I should have buffed, yeah, I should have buffed earlier. Alright, no worries, no worries. I mean, this is, no one has ever said that this was an easy boss. He's not. Man, I, I can't even get to the second phase at this point. Like, it's been so long since I actually got to the second phase. Looks like that one attempt at the start was my one good attempt for the day. And I squandered it. Nice. That's a nice landing. You see me do more damage. The reason is because I switched out to... Lloyd's sword ring instead of the instead of the wolf ring because the wolf ring was not doing much for me honestly yeah I know I was gonna get hit fuck this boss is a lot of HP They like them high HP boys, don't they, for this DLC. Hate that move that breaks lock on. Cool. 
cool. That was a wasted heal. Finally, second phase. Here we go. Oh man, I'm nervous. I'm not not even saying anything because I'm like, oh shit. Delays. How is he not dead? Oh, he's dead. Look at it. <sighs> look at my HP. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, look at my HP. I thought the heavy attack was gonna get... Holy fuck. Five... I actually can't believe it. I actually cannot believe that I survived with five HP. Sometimes I really do believe that I'm the luckiest person ever playing this game man, I get so many free wins like this fucking hell alright we got the dark soul I don't remember if you can do anything else here there is something else you can do here uh, whatever whatever I don't care I survived with 5 HP oh yeah and people asking well Midir fuck Midir I'm not doing that boss just like fuck the ancient dragon in Dark Souls 2. Maybe if I'm really bored, I'll come back off screen and beat it. And then it's like, whatever. Where is she? There you are. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't even know where I'm leveling up to. Like, it's no point, but. I've discovered my peace. I cannot believe it. I legit cannot believe it. And now you're gonna get deny that that was just pure luck, but damn, this boss has an insane amount of HP. I thought you would at least have. Fuck. I honestly thought she'd have some unique dialogue. Anyways, we have one little trip to make. Back to DLC number one, DLC numero uno, to the Ariandel Chapel, that's the one. We'll give her the Dark Soul, you know, do all that good shit. 
You can make weapons out of Gale's soul. Uh, a sword, a great sword, I think. And the crossbow. Once you know. It's up to you if you want to do that. Holy shit. Uh, there's also the... You know what? I don't care about the prince. Nameless King. That's his name. So, you know, I always want to call him the Nameless Prince, but no, the Nameless King. Honestly, you know what? Nah. I want to get this playthrough done. I know that I'm not enjoying this game, or I wasn't enjoying this game, but you know. This new game is on the horizon. I'm gonna, you know, My thanks. wrap this one up. I'm the Dark Lord, name it after me. You might want to watch your hair though, with all that fire. Yeah, about that. Cheers, goodbye. Cheers, that's such a British thing to say. But you might want to repaint your uncle as well, because that fool ain't coming back. I'll tell you that much. Spoilers, by the way. Sorry. Alright, we are going back to the kiln of the first flame. Because there is, of course, one more boss man waiting for us. Probably one that I'm horribly overpowered for. But actually, I don't know how this boss scales, if he scales at all. Oh, we can summon Yuri as well, can't we? Or whatever her name is. Yeah, I know about that. See, I kind of don't want to do it. But I kind of want to do it for lore purposes. I mean, where is she at though? There she is. I'm gonna do it. I again I know. Maybe this is cheating, but I mean this boss is easy anyway. I beat the hardest boss in the game already. Uh Demon Princess, so But it's just like so appropriate to summon her. She's an edgelord anyways, you know, with her gimp mask and her Uchigitana. Alright girl. Let's go and do this. It's just fitting, you know, the Dark Lord and her Number one servant. Gonna go and fuck shit up here. God, it's been a while with this boss. Oh shit. He's taking hella damage. And this is the summon and summon version, you know, where he takes like... There's like extra defense, but man, I've forgotten his moveset. Not gonna lie. Is she even doing anything? She kinda is, but not much. So far... Yuria... I'd say underwhelming. Damn, I got laser sorted. Look at her flying. Can we break? Yeah, go do that. Okay, this is just abuse, straight up. He's not even gonna get time to switch to his forms. Oh shit, I screwed up. Yeah, that was that, that's kind of cheating. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, Yuria. Uh, yeah, just fucking hell, she's stupid. Oh yeah, he does that every single time for the start. Oh yeah. <laughs> Why did I think that would have like a blind spot to it? Like, holy shit, that is... 
Is that gonna hurt? You can tell how much effort I'm putting into this boss fight. Oh. Would be nice if I can get unstuck. Okay, she has a ton of heals. She's just getting abused. Holy shit, the AoE on that. Yeah, she ain't have no heals left. Look at the kick. This is a funny boss. I love this weapon because like the way the attack animation works is basically cheating because you like go low go so low to the ground Okay now I have to like Watch out a little bit. Wolf ring. Should have gotten the wolf ring. Oh well. Whatever. This boss is hella easy. <laughs> like, did you see how little like thought I was putting into it? Okay, this is where we can't fuck up. Summon the fire keeper. Okay, it's not what we want to do. We want to summon. Yuria. Okay. How the fuck do you do this? So there's Yuria. I mean, there should be a Yuria. Please don't tell me you have to like have her survive or some shit like that. Hopefully she ain't dead or something and this is like screwed it up weird that was the weirdest weird I've ever said oh, where this hoe at alright you know what it's phone time So apparently the phone is telling me you just have to link the fire. I'm kind of scared. Like, what the fuck? If this screws up and this game been lying to me, I'm going to be disappointed. Well, actually, then the wiki will be lying to me. That's it. It said, touch the flame and link the fire. Man, this better be not, not be playing with me. Yeah, this is different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is not how it was. I knew it. Yes. 
I was just unsure. Oh, we have two waifus. Nice. That's it? Seriously, that's all you get? It's weird because I have seen this ending before, but my mind was still telling me that there was more to it. Yeah. Is that ending worth all that extra effort? Honestly, I'd probably say no, but... There's one more thing we need to do. I mean, it's cool. It's probably as close to a quote-unquote power fantasy as Dark Souls is ever going to get. Because basically you become the entire lord of a kingdom. So technically you win if you want to become a badass. And if you want to rule over a bunch of sweaty-ass hollows for the rest of time. Yes. Oh. Okay. I honestly thought you can get her set, but maybe not. Whatever. Ending is good enough as it is. Uh, cool ending, again, for something I haven't seen before. There's only one ending that I've not seen, or I've not done, but there is no like achievement tied to it, and it's kind of a dick ending. Where you kill the firekeeper. Yeah, that's not... I kind of like the firekeeper, so... You know. I don't want to just, like, murk her. Alright, I guess I'll show what you can make from Gale's soul. And, of course, the soul of cinders. You can make the bonfire sword. Alright, begin this transposition. So you can make the sunlight spear miracle. And, whoa, Demon Scar, it's a dex weapon. You know how we feel about dex weapons? Yeah, you can make this, the repeating crossbow. And Gale's Greatsword, that's the one. Oh, it requires dex. Yeah, it's an okay weapon from what I heard. Alright, well. Uh, that is going to kind of unceremoniously conclude the Return to Dark Souls playthrough. I mean unceremoniously because I didn't like end it at the credit scene with a big speech or anything like that. Not that I give big speeches, but hey, this game is really fun. Again, when I say that this is not my favorite Souls game, doesn't mean that I dislike this game as it is. I think it's really fun. Uh, it's just that, again, I've said this before, that I think the replayability is low. However, once in a while like this, I love this game. I think the combat system is fun. Weapons are fun, bosses are fun. I kind of like the whole progression of it. Even though I do think some of the bosses in the DLC do go a little bit overboard in this game with uh, just how tanky they are. But that's more of a DLC issue, I would say, than a main game issue. So yeah, that's going to continue, con continue, conclude Dark Souls 3. I honestly don't know when I'm going to return to this game. Probably... One day I'll stream it, maybe do a challenge run or something like that. I don't know, but again, I this is for sure not the last time I will be playing this game. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this series. Thanks for all the comments, likes, support, whatever. I really appreciate everything. So yeah, I'm going to wrap it up here and sit down. And yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and goodbye.